So surely, boy, if, if, if I go set up a company, I'm the director of that company, um, do you advise that I pay myself a salary from that company? Is it advisable or not? It's actually uh, one of those interesting questions because entrepreneurs will come and tell you, or property investors will come and tell you, say, listen, what is the most efficient way to return money to myself? Because yes. at the end of the day, you're going to business to actually return money to. So salary is one of, one of those that uh, typically uh, property investor will, will use to return money back to themselves to, for well-being, of, yeah, of course, right? But it's also crucial to say you need to compare, right? Um, where you, Maybe let me give you an example of how do we typically return money back to the shareholders. It could be salary, it could be dividends, it could be return of what you call contributed tax capital. Yeah. Yeah, whatever you put in, into the company, you return it back. Yeah. So in this case too, whether it's actually better to use salary, it also depends on what, in your personal capacity, are you already any, any form of income? Because it might not actually be smart to actually, where you're already sitting at the marginal tax rate of 40% or 45% to actually be getting salary because you will be taxed at 45%. Yeah. So you might actually consider paying what dividends where you're actually being taxed at what effectively maybe like 20%. Of course, you'll, you'll pay tax at 27% or 28% at the company level. But yeah. if you look at the effective tax rate, it's actually lower than if you were to pay directly the salary. So it also, each person's circumstances, it's actually crucial to actually uh, do the numbers to say, where are you sitting at in terms of in your personal capacity? And then compare that because if you're not earning any form of income, it actually can be advisable to actually earn the salary at that particular point in time. Yeah. Interesting. Thank you. Thank you.